We're glad you're with us today. Kentucky has a long, rich history. Telling Kentucky's story in a most engaging way is the mission of the Kentucky Humanities Council. We're joined by the Executive Director of the Humanities Council, former Congressman Ben Chandler. Thank you very much for coming in today. I always love to be with you, Barbara. Well, and I know you have a real passion for history and reading. Uh, you're a perfect fit at the Humanities <laughs> Council that way. I know you love it. Why is this mission so important? Well, I think it's important uh, to all people in Kentucky to have a, a good sense of their own tradition, of where they came from, pride in Kentucky. And that's what we're doing, among other things. We're, we're, our mission is to instill pride in the mm -hmm. people of Kentucky about their past and to help them understand where they're going. And that's what the humanities is all about. And tell us about the Chautauqua program. Well, the Chautauqua program is, is a very interesting program. It was started as a result of the 1992 Bicentennial Celebration in Kentucky. Uh, it was the Humanities Council's contribution to that celebration, and they never dreamed, I think, at that time that it would be a permanent program. But it was so popular. I think there were maybe four or five Chautauquans to begin with. Now we've got 31, and it's been going on for, what, 23 years now? And these actors and actresses portrayal, portray real life Kentuckians a lot of times in schools. What's it like when school children sit around and see history come into life? Well, it really is neat. I've been to a lot of school presentations, and uh, when a character like Daniel Boone comes in and it looks like Daniel Boone, behaves like Daniel Boone, it is in character as Daniel Boone. It's the sort of experience that young people may never forget for the rest of their lives, and it makes history come alive. It really does. Uh, where you also tell the, the story of Kentucky, I know, through the Speakers Bureau and in other ways. Where can people get more information about the program and learn more about the Humanities Council? Well, if they go online at kyhumanities.org, they mm -hmm. can uh, certainly find out what we do and what programs are available. But we do have a Speakers Bureau with well over 50 programs uh, about Kentucky culture, essentially. All kinds of things Kentucky. Uh, we send speakers from one end of the state to the other. It's a statewide organization, and it's Kentucky's arm of the National Endowment for the Humanities. Uh, we have, as you say, the Chautauqua program, and that's available not only to the schools, but civic groups all over the state. We do some 500 programs a year. Uh, again, it, it's statewide, and it has proved to be very popular over the years. Well, we hope more people will take, it, take advantage of the opportunity and help the Humanities Council as well. It's kyhumanities.org. That's right. Thank you.